New staff has been working all week at Nahant Marsh in Davenport building a playground. It is part of our parent company Nextar Broadcasting's Founders Day of Caring. This year's project was to turn an empty lot into a place where kids could play. We've been working all week on this project and it wrapped up today. Local force Carrie Keene joins us live with the final reveal. Carrie. Tiffany, we're at Nahant Marsh, and you have to admit, our staff worked really hard this week. And just look at this beautiful structure I'm standing in. This is called a wiki up, and this is just part of the natural playground that we have created here at Nahant Marsh. And right along here, all these are natural edibles. They're going to grow into berry bushes and crab tree bushes, and they're going to have uh, natural birds set on these posts right here. There's a balancing log, which is kind of intimidating. I won't lie for someone with my balance. But over here, there's going to be a trellis with lots of natural plants and some stepping stones. And there's signs all over that show exactly how to interact with all these things. And there's people from sales, production, promotions, and on-air staff have all been out here helping all week. The heat made the work especially difficult. Plus, there was a lot of digging, more than anticipated, and moving dirt around. Nahant is a popular place for field trips. Local children come to learn about the environment, and now they'll have this extra space for more interactive learning. Our chief meteorologist, Andy McRae, was a big part of planning and organizing this project right here. He says that this final day, when they reveal the finished project, is the best part. Really, the best part about it is seeing that finished product at the end of the week and knowing that kids are going to be able to come out and play and have a good time for years to come. Now, the people at Nahant Marsh are so excited about all of this. They were just talking about how great it looks, and they say it's about 95% complete. There's just some little details they have left to do, and all the people who were able to volunteer this week were excited as well. Live in Davenport, Carrie Keene, Local 4 News. It has come a long way, Carrie. Thank you. Davenport's Modern Wood